Hello YouTube, Intuitive Edge here. Tonight I'd like to look at what's coming up for us this week. We've got uh, lots in the news, lots going on in our world. Let's see what uh, what the cards have to say, what we're going to be facing this week. So, give me a moment while I shuffle up and uh, we'll get started. So we're going to look at the energies surrounding us this week and what's going to be... What's going to be on everybody's minds this week uh, in terms of the news and that kind of thing? What's going to be capturing our attention? All right, give me just a moment. All right, a couple more times here. All right, cut the deck. Okay, so what do we got going on this week? I'm just going to do three quick cards today. Okay. So, um, there's going to be some fated, there's a fated quality about, uh, about our week ahead. We have the wheel of, the wheel, the wheel of fortune, wheel of destiny, uh, things set in motion that, that can't be stopped. Um, now with, with it being reversed is kind of interesting. Um, generally speaking, when you've got the wheel reversed, see it can be a resistance um this is a card of like destiny things that are are destined to happen it's part of fate karma what have you um when it's reversed it's like resisting what's happening so there may be some things that that happen that there may be a lot of pushback or a lot of resistance from people um and it may feel like things are beyond our control, um, that we don't have a say or we, you know, we, things are just happening. We don't have any control over it. And there's like a lot of pushback or resistance that, you know, um, that's, that's actually not true. I mean, we, we have, we do have power in our lives. We do have control over certain circumstances that are within our control, um, I mean, it depends on, on, you know, how, how esoterically you want to look at that. I mean, there are some people who say, yeah, you, you have control over your, over everything that happens to you, it, you know, in, on some level, on some esoteric, anyway, we, we won't go that deep. <laughs> well, that's, that's, you know, if you want to have that conversation, that's fine, but I won't go that deep here. <laughs> um, this is just to say there's going to be pushback and resistance. To the to some things that we might be seeing in the news or what's going on around us. Okay, all right. We'll keep it simple. How's that? <laughs> no sense over complicating it. Okay. All right. We have the Earth King reverse. Earth Earth King. This card reversed means that somebody is being deceptive. Somebody is being underhanded. Yeah, pro usually a male figure, but somebody is being cunning sneaky, conniving, greedy, um, an all-around bad, bad ombre, so to speak. Um, this is, this is like materialistic, uh, we'll do anything for money, kind of cutthroat. So, there may be somebody like that, that, that is in the news, somebody who's dastardly, <laughs> um, Anyway, we may we it, it, this is a card of corruption, if you, honestly. So we may be seeing some of that, um, either uncovered or something about someone who's being corrupt. Um, now this is an interesting card. We have another king. We have two kings here. Two kings and a wheel. Wheel of destiny with two kings. Um, I don't know. I I don't want to say like good king, bad king, but. <laughs> um, but there, I, I want to think on the world stage with the world players that there may be some, um, there may be some corruption. But there's the 
there's a C king also. Um, and that's, that's a little different feel to it. That's like um, diplomatic, somebody who is honorable and wise. And then you've got somebody who's cutthroat and deceptive. <laughs> so those two energies right next to each other are probably going to be playing each other, playing themselves out on some level. Either one person, and when I say king, it could mean like um, just a, a strong figure, probably a political figure of some sort. You've got like good cop, bad cop kind of feel. So those two energies, may be, they may be facing off. They may be butting heads. It, they might be related to each other in, in terms of, you know, not blood related. But, I mean, they may be doing things that hit heads and these two worlds collide. Or they could just be, we hear about somebody like this in the news and then this other person is, like, doing the good cop thing and they're trying to route out corruption and... So I think in some way they, these two might be kind of crossing hairs, crossing wires, um, playing off each other's energy. Um, maybe, I don't know, some sort of, there's some sort of yin-yang thing going on between these two. That's interesting. I don't know who these two people are, but um, but we are going to be seeing that the uh, good versus evil, bad, good, bad polarity playing itself out. Um, so, anyway, and, and there's something faded about it that's going to leave some people feeling like they're in resistance mode. So, okay. Um, I could go on, but I'm going to leave that here. I'm going to keep it short. Um, just something to look for that, that we might be facing this week or we might be seeing in the news kind of playing itself out. So, anyway, um, I know it's short. Um, I will do more. I will see you guys at the next video. Take care, and uh, if you like what I do, subscribe and help me grow my channel. All right, everybody, take care. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.